ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ವೀಕ್ಷಕರೇ ಸಿರಿ ಮೊಬೈಲ್ ಟಿವಿಯ ಎಲ್ಲ ನೋಡುಗರಿಗೂ ಇವತ್ತಿನ ಕಾರ್ಯಕ್ರಮಕ್ಕೆ ಆತ್ಮೀಯವಾದ ಸ್ವಾಗತವನ್ನು ಕೋರ್ತಾ ಇದ್ದೇನೆ ಸುಮಾರು ಮೂರು ವರ್ಷಗಳಿಂದ ಚಿತ್ರೀಕರಣದಲ್ಲಿದ್ದು ಇದೀಗ ಬಿಡುಗಡೆಗೆ ಸಿದ್ಧವಾಗಿರುವಂತಹ ನೀನಿಲ್ಲದ ಮಳೆ ಚಿತ್ರ ಇನ್ನೇನು ಕೆಲವೇ ದಿನಗಳಲ್ಲಿ ನಿಮ್ಮ ಮುಂದೆ ಬರಲಿಕ್ಕಿದೆ ಈ ಚಿತ್ರದಲ್ಲಿ ಹಲವಾರು ವಿಶೇಷತೆಗಳಿದೆ ಅದರಲ್ಲಿ ಮುಖ್ಯವಾಗಿ ತಬಲಾ ನಾಣಿ ಹಾಗೆ ಗಿರೀಶ್ ಕಾರ್ನಾಡ್ ಇಂತಹ ದೊಡ್ಡ ತಾರಾಗಣ ಒಂದು ಕಡೆ ಇದ್ರೆ ಇನ್ನೊಂದು ಕಡೆಯಲ್ಲಿ ಈ ಹಿಂದೆ ಬಾಯ್ ಫ್ರೆಂಡ್ ಸಿನಿಮಾವನ್ನ ಮಾಡಿರುವಂತಹ ಜನಾರ್ದನ್ ಅವರು ಈ ಚಿತ್ರಕ್ಕೆ ಮತ್ತೊಮ್ಮೆ ಆಕ್ಷನ್ ಕಟ್ ಅನ್ನ ಹೇಳಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಇದೆಲ್ಲಕ್ಕಿಂತ ಒಂದು ಅದ್ಭುತವಾದ ವಿಚಾರ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿದ್ರೆ ನಮ್ಮ ಚಂದನವನಕ್ಕೆ ಅಮೆರಿಕದ ಪ್ರಜೆ ಒಬ್ರು ಎಂಟ್ರಿ ಕೊಡ್ತಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಅವರೇ ಇವತ್ತು ನಮ್ ಜೊತೆಗಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಅವರ ಹೆಸರು ವೆಲ್ಲರಿ ಮಾರ್ವಿ ಅಂತ ಮೇಡಮ್ ನಮ್ಮ ಕಾರ್ಯಕ್ರಮಕ್ಕೆ ಪ್ರೀತಿಯ ಸ್ವಾಗತ ಮುಖ್ಯವಾಗಿ ಮೊದಲಿಗೆ ಹೇಳಲಿಕ್ಕೆ ಇಷ್ಟಪಡ್ತೀನಿ ಇವರಿಗೆ ಕನ್ನಡ ಅಷ್ಟ ಬರಲ್ಲ ಆದ್ರೂ ಇವತ್ತು ಕೆಲವೊಂದು ವಿಚಾರದಲ್ಲಿ ಇವರು ಕನ್ನಡದಲ್ಲಿ ಮಾತಾಡ್ತೀವಿ ನಾವು ಕ್ವಶನ್ ಏನೋ ಇಂಗ್ಲಿಷ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಇರುತ್ತೆ ಆದ್ರೆ ಅವರಿಗೆ ಗೊತ್ತಿರುವಷ್ಟು ಕನ್ನಡದಲ್ಲಿ ಮಾತಾಡ್ತಾರೆ and eventually when i was 16 i moved to new york to study and now i'm here in india working <laughs> okay how you came into theater bangalore the bangalore i um, met the uh, producer director janardan in the film in new york we were shooting a short film and he told me about the book the film the project and he brought me here to the canada industry okay Uh, have you spoken in Kannada in this movie? Yes. Uh, I was well, English Kannada. I picked I picked up a lot of words so I kept learning. But yes, half Kannada half English. Not too much English, but more Kannada. Where you came started in acting industry. Um well, I started theater back home in Peru. I was 8 years old. Um I was doing musicals, theater stage like Broadway style. Um, I continued to do theater when I moved to New York at school, college in Manhattan um, and then started doing short films, uh, independent films, for projects, serials, TV shows and I did two short in the, uh, Indian movies, short films, small Tamil and, um, and I met Jan Arda and he introduced me to the Canada film. Wow. Yeah. What was the experience in this movie? It was beautiful. It was great. I'm really happy um I got to learn more about, you know, the acting world in a different language. It was amazing to work with Jan Ardan with uh, Girish Karnad. He plays my father in a movie, very strong character. Um he brings to the film to the story and he plays my father, so I got to share a lot of beautiful scenes with him. Is this your first movie or what? In Canada in future film big feature film first yes mm-hmm. big feature yes how was your experience in the new guy uh, mr amok amok janarda it was great it was good he um he also um he made it easier for me to understand the the scenes he, you know he introduced me to this new world of the indian industry film and um always learning always learning together um you know he's very like into comedy action in a more like I'm very dramatic and um it was a, a very nice combination what's your role in this movie my role in the movie um the um the daughter of a very well known indian politician and um she has a lot of money you know she she's studying abroad in washington because her father has money they give her everything But what I like about this character is she's not spoiled. You know, she's not a mean girl who's spoiled. She's very smart, very independent, very strong uh character and I want that to the young girls to see that, you know. It doesn't matter how much money you have. You have to be humble, strong and very uh funny as well. What you saying? Why did it? Because I like to experience new things. I like to keep learning, to keep uh, meeting new people, new environments, and I'm happy that I did. So hopefully I can stay. Uh, have you spoken in Canada? Yes, I I had to like prepare a lot. <laughs> obviously, you know, every yeah, day. Some words. Yeah, like <laughs> some words um, that I remember. Nano Valeri, Nano Tumba Chana Girini to be here in India, uh, and. Um, 
I'll remember coffee back it too. <laughs> Please. <laughs> and um yeah, Tanti. <laughs> oh, <laughs> How did you manage to talk Canada? It was hard. Okay, it was hard at the beginning. But I like to learn new languages. So it made it easier, you know. I will ask the technicians, I will ask the director so many questions. So I, I kept learning every day. Now I forget, but in the moment I remembered a lot. What's the highlight of this movie? The highlights of the movie is the story of the Indians in other countries. I think it's it's amazing that a movie could um, show you there's Indians out there raising their voices to tell you a story about how the people treat Indians in other countries. And it, it's important to see, you know, what we can do about it. Did anyone teach you Kannada in uh, shooting sets? Mm, not necessarily. I'm going to teach you Valerie, but um, there were a lot of people that were willing to help me. Yes, everybody, everyone. Uh, yeah. I think in Washington, D.C., we had different weather, different climates, but very cold. You know, you can see different textures in the movie, different um, scenarios. And then New York, you know, we have all this beautiful lighting. And then we came to India and we went to Bidar. These beautiful ruins in more than 700 years of history. You know, and we went to this beautiful building in Bidar. Um, you can see from the top this amazing city. And it was great to see everybody, you know, from the top of the building. Um, very, the, that's the climate of um, the scene, of the movie. Tell me about in this movie, music is actually uh, Indra oh, He knows how much I love the music <laughs> and the songs. It was very touchy, very, uh, very melancholic, very upbeat beat too. Different rhythms, um, amazing lyrics. I fell in love with the lyrics and that, that helped me learn more in Canada. Like, I'll pick up a few words. Yeah. Our song was one Yes, uh, I'm going to say it again. My voice is now beautiful, so I don't want people to criticize me. <laughs> I'm going to repeat the same. Um, uh, I remember when I listen to the lyrics, I sing everything. Yes, I, I remember when I listen. Can you ever do things? Um, I think I would. I'll prepare myself. I'll definitely. Yes, I want to now. Yes, let's do it. <laughs> yes, what is the memorable moment in this movie? Bidar. Bidar. One of yeah, Bidar. One of the most favorite scenes in Bidar in this. In the ruins, how we got to shoot different, uh, you know, shots, and the incredible place, and the music, and the red dress that I'm wearing with beautiful lyrics, just singing the songs. It was more like feeling, you know, things that I want to say in the movie more than the script. You know, I think the music it really touched me, and uh, I think that in India, the shoots in India, it was great. I think most of them, but most be that be that I remember a lot. Did you have any uncomfortable moment in the Indian shooting sets? Mm, not really, no. Um, every, everyone really take, took care of every single person in the, in the shooting. Um, I enjoyed every scene. Maybe like the sun in that it was very hard, you know, burned my arm. But it's, it's nature. You can go against nature. So, um, no, not really. I enjoyed everything. I loved it. I'm very positive today. <laughs> Tell me about Canada industry. Canada industry. Did you know? I've been watching a lot of films lately. Um, I'm, I'm starting to recognize a lot of people in the film. I don't remember their names. Which person do you know in Canada industry? I've seen films with Brian Cox, Jennifer Lawrence, Jennifer Lawrence, Jennifer I know them from before. It, um, they, they're amazing. Okay. They're people I look up to to learn. You what, know. what you know about the industry, Sandalwood? Sandalwood, um, I, I mean, Canada has a beautiful background of history. Mm -hmm. um, there's so many films out there, so many films that I really appreciate that um, I would love to see more. 
of the industry, you know, getting bigger and bigger. Which cinema you watch in Canada? Uh, just last one that I watched was um, Mungaru Malay. Wow. That was the one that I, I watched the other day and it was like... It was blockbuster cinema. Yeah, and yeah, and yeah, was yeah, yeah. And it was, then, yeah. wow, yes. And I was like, those movies I want to work in. <laughs> yes. Well, we're talking. We'll see what happens. Um, maybe other industries as well. But Canada, um, I would love to keep trying, to keep learning, and uh, we'll see. We're talking. We'll see what happens. We'll see. Talk about total experience in this movie. Uh, yes. Well, the experience has been, again, amazing because it helped me learn so many things. Um, not just as, as an actor, as a person. I got to know India closer and deeper that I would love to come back here and work maybe in a documentary myself, produce, direct as well in the future. Um, I'm a journalist as well and I saw the other side of India that I would love to explore. So really this film brought me to life to really see what I really want for myself. Compared to life, what's your uh, philosophy? Compared to life, my feel is enjoy the moment, keep learning. There's there's always something beyond of things that you know. There's amazing and wonderful people that will just help, not just help you grow, but to learn, learn from everybody you meet. Okay. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Once again. Yela Viksha Karigu, Happy New Year. Please do subscribe to Siri Mobile TV. Siri Mobile TV. Siri Mobile TV ya yella update gali gagi. Facebook page na like maadi. YouTube channel na subscribe agi. Hachina notification gali gagi. Bell button na click maadi.